I'm one of those people that really needs eight hours at least, and or else I can really feel it. So I always try to prioritize sleep. The space station is operating on Greenwich Mean Time, so London time. So sometimes we're down here supporting on the ground, it's the middle of the night for us, and I might just have to do one or two shifts in the middle of the night per week and then go back to my normal schedule the rest of the week. And we do a lot of international travel. Um, we'll be training in Japan or in Europe. That's really hard on the body. It's really not good for us. Some of our medical personnel have developed some sleep shifting schedules, and so they'll help us sort of offset that maybe give us some melatonin or if sleeping aids if necessary um, to help us shift and make the most of that so that our bodies can adapt more quickly. Um, you know, sometimes we'll fly to Russia and then arrive and then have training the next day. And you don't want to be super jet lagged. You need to be awake and alert and you know, you're learning things that your lives will depend on later. So they are pretty good at, at providing us with that kind of information and support and we can meet with the flight docs. They'll develop this whole schedule for us and, and help us through that whole process.